Hey McGinn, welcome back to our latest read aloud. Uh, it's Mr. Lone, I'm glad to see you guys again. I uh, have a short <clears throat> book for you today, but it's one with an important message and it goes with uh, something we've been talking about in some of my classes, in a lot of classes this year, and it's being accepting of others, being proud of who you are, and uh, let's get to it now. This is, what if what makes you different makes you amazing? What if your hair was big and orange and really bright? What if one eye was green and the other eye was blue as night? What if you were quiet and very small? What if you were super, super duper tall? What if your color was unusual and unique in its own way? What if instead of standing still, you liked to sway? You see, being different is special and can give your spirit a lift. Being different is beautiful and magnificent. It's what makes life a gift. If all of us were exactly alike and totally the same, We'd be boring and dull, and that would be a shame. Everyone is someone special. We are all one of a kind. Just how, just show the world who you are. Let your newness shine. What if your big orange hair was the perfect place to rest a while? What if your quiet nature made you the perfect helper for an injured crocodile? What if the way you like to sway encouraged your friends to have fun, dance, and play? What if being your own color made you stand out in the crowd and seeing you made everyone shout their differences out loud? Being different is really amazing and perfectly okay. Each of us has something to share in our own unique way. So what if we celebrate each other and what makes us different too? Cause today is the perfect day to be exactly and totally you. So I hope you take this book by Sandra Maximin, and you look at yourself and you find something unique and special about you that makes you puff out your chest and be proud. I hope you look at friends and you find something unique and wonderful about them and you tell them you appreciate who they are. Remember, we are all one big family, especially at McGinn. Bye guys.